What's up guys, I'm back. Pretty excited actually, I just got back um, from my lunch break. I start working another five minutes, so I'm gonna make this video really quick. Uh, I wanted to show you a lunchtime haul, which is super, super awesome. Uh, I think you guys might appreciate what I got today and might actually be a little surprised at how much I ended up paying for it. So two things I want to show you guys. Here in Canada, we don't have a Dollar General, family dollar, or anything like that, but we do have good old Dollarama. A Dollarama doesn't often carry Hot Wheels. You know, every now and then they'll put out some stuff. When they do, they got some good stuff. Um, so I'm going to show you guys, before I show you the haul, I'm going to show you what I paid. Um, let me see if this picks it up. 1978. And if you see there, got a bunch of Hot Wheels at $2 and one Hot Wheel at $1.50. What those cars are, I'm going to show you guys right now. So I ended up picking up eight cars at $2. For myself at least, I picked up another bag of the same cars, which is a set of something, which you guys will see shortly for a buddy of mine. So right off the bat, I got me two of these. They're the panel bus, the panel bus and the Volkswagen um, drag truck from the Grateful Dead. So they release the pop culture set for $2. These are the first two I saw, which are usually the hardest ones to find. I found these on the pegs. The only two that were on the pegs. So, you know, I did some searching around and I noticed that um, these were actually looked at and put somewhere else. Um, the real set was sitting on some pegs just down the aisle. So, I go down the aisle and what do I find? I find another set, a complete set. So, I got myself um, two drag buses and drag trucks, but I also got me a full set. So, I got a total of eight of these cars, for me at least, because the drag truck and the panel bus are just totally awesome. I had to get an extra two so I can crack those open. But I also have a full set that I'm going to keep carded because the artwork, as you guys know, is totally awesome. So two books a piece. You can't go wrong. These never hit retail here at uh, Walmart or Toys R Us. And if they did, they were going for $4.99 to $5.49 or something. That's what Toys R Us charges. They have a little bit of a premium over Walmart. Um, so, yeah, that covers that. As far as pop culture, and you might be asking, what was that $2.50 car? Well, that was a mainline car. And it was a nice one that I ended up finding. I ended up getting the Super Fat Boy Harley. So over, overall, I had an awesome, awesome afternoon and a great lunch. I didn't even eat because, man, I saw these and uh, I just scooped them up. So I'm heading back to work in about three minutes. Wanted to show you guys this haul. I'm just going to wrap everything up, get back to work. Probably grab a quick bite, and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Hope you guys have enjoyed, and happy hunting, guys.